Warning! Starting a new game will override your autosave, if you have one yet. Before you start, let me tell you how to play the game. Left click interacts with stuff. Right click looks at things. Be sure to try both. Move the mouse to the top of the screen to see your inventory and stuff. That's it! Pretty easy, huh? This video game shop reported a theft of some games. I should ask around. I should also remind the player that right click looks at stuff, which can prove entertaining if not essential. Brown Bread Souls That game is harder than any other game in existence! Most people can't even get past the main menu! Gears of Snore it's the sequel to Gears of Boar. Twice the boredom of the original! Ori and the Deaf Forest. In that game, the forest can't hear you scream. FIFA 2020. The yearly football release that doesn't really change much from the previous year. Quantum Tea Break. The game only lasts 10 minutes, but what a thrill ride of tea and cookies! Forza Portrait. You play as a car that paints portraits of people. Rogue Hate. You would die in that game more times than you will use the toilet in one lifetime. Spider Manic Matt. Become a forum user with a ridiculous username on the World Wide Web. Betroid. Play as an android with OCD and clean a door handle 49,342 times an hour. Blood Bank Your mission! Get to the Blood Bank to donate blood! Wow, such a nice game! But to get to the Blood Bank, you gotta slice and dice people who will try to stop you! Ah, uh, take it back! It says on the back, 8 out of 10 cowards recommend this game! Guard Duty it's a point-and-click adventure game, made by Sick Chicken Studios. You mean we're advertising a game not made by Because Because Games? Yes, it's great fun! Any other games you want to advertise by other developers while you're at it? Well, there is Captain Disaster. Stop already! Skyro the Dragon. Sadly, only the logo screen is on the disc. You have to download everything else. Lame. In this game, you have to stand still until you die of natural causes. Thrilling. NBA Gambling Simulator. The ultimate gambling game! Also includes a small basketball mini game. It's about five minutes long and uh, you, uh, you have to press X and then you win and then you get to gamble again and, uh, and again and again. And, uh, until you've spent actually about five thousand pounds of your real money before you realise it, and you've become a gambling freak on what's supposed to be an NBA game, but looks more like a gambling machine. Um, pretty bad, really. They should ban things like that. Pretty disgusting. You remember when the game used to be about basketball? It was actually about basketball and playing basketball. Do you remember that? Cause I don't. It was so many years ago. Oh my god. What's so special about these Stitch consoles? You can switch between playing the game and the game playing you. That's... Uh, different. What's so special about these Stitch consoles? You can switch between... That's... Uh, what's that? Heaven, Hell and the Netherworld is an old free to download PC game. The graphics are a bit naff, but it's pretty funny. It's available now, on itch. What's that? Trails and Traces is an adventure game that's a lot less bonkers than our world. It's available now, on itch. Wait, that's my face on the box. Yes, in this game you play as Detective Boardhard. You! Who wouldn't want to play as me? Plus, you get to visit multiple locations in a bigger game. Cool. Detective Boardhard, Case File, Death of the Space Dino. It's available now, on itch. I heard about these in the paper. 
They bombed so hard, shops have been trying to sell them as doorstoppers. It's a poster advertising their deals. The terms and conditions look very complicated. That's why they hired me. They seem to be angry at the other person. They have the audacity to think that Export 1 is superior to PlayStation 4. That's because it is. I have a Gamer Boy thingy at home. Then you are not a gamer. We can agree on something for once. However will I sleep at night. Don't pay attention to those bozos. They're well armored for a chef. Sometimes the boiling water can spit. <laughs> nice. Wow, that hairstyle is amazing. Objection! Stop staring at my hair. Sorry. I'd like to ask you some questions. Are you wearing any clothes? I'm wearing shorts. Pew. You have terrible leadership skills. Okay. How are you doing? Okay. Cool, cool. Do you know anything about some games that were stolen from this branch of GameStop? I don't know. Aren't you the manager? I don't know. This has been really enlightening. Thank you for your time. Okay. When I picked up my gun this morning, I accidentally picked up the wrong one. I'd like to ask you some questions. You may stop my testimony. You're very smartly dressed. Are you the manager? Oh no 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 no. This place is casual wear. I just love wearing this suit. You seem rather calm. What are you hiding? That's better. I love your hair. It's mesmerizing. Um, thanks. I only spend three hours in the morning styling it. Not much to it, really. I'm Detective Boiled Heart. Do you know a Dick Gumfoot? Dick Gumfoot? <laughs> what a strange name. Objection! Boiled Heart is just as strange. Uh, you have a point. Well, anyway, I'm here about some stolen video games. Ah, yes. All of our copies of Finally Final Fantasy XXX have been taken. That sounds rather saucy. Is it a game for adults only? Uh, no. It's Roman numerals. It's the 30th game in the series. Blimey. What can you tell me about the finally Final Fantasy games that were stolen? Nothing more than what I already told you. Have you tried asking my colleague Abraham? Thank you for your time. Case dismissed. I'd like to ask you some questions. What can you tell me about the finally Final Fantasy games that were stolen? Oh yeah, I remember booking those in. They came in a delivery box, which could contain some clues, but I can't remember what I did with the box. Jeez. Can you really not remember what you did with the box? Mm, nope. Can you really... Mm. Thank you for your time. Okay. I'd like to ask you some questions. Why are you so angry? Because I am so angry! Rawr! I'm glad we cleared that up. You're so... What? Mm. Never mind. You have such hard muscles, Mr. Muscle Man. Damn straight I do, boy! Is there any chance you happen to see the staff moving at delivery box? That I did. They flattened it and put the box under the counter. The fool! Thanks. Indeed. Teal'c? Who? I'm Crotas. Don't try my patience, boy. 
So, you saw Abraham put the delivery box onto the counter? Yes, fool! Thank you for your time. No problem, boy! I'd like to ask you some questions. What do you do for a living? I'm the head chef at Burger King. In my spare time, I also kill alien bastards from other worlds. Did they deserve it? Hell yeah, they're taking our jobs. I don't like you. Nobody likes them. That's not true. I like me. You smell of egg. That's not surprising. I wash my armor in egg yolk every day. Weird. You have such sexy armor. It provides great protection. Kruta saw Abraham put the delivery box on the counter. Nah, okay. Thank you for your time. Whatever. I'd like to ask you some questions. Protest saw you put the box under the counter. Oh yeah, that's right. All of you, follow me. Huh? Nah, I don't know. Yeah, I'll put it on the counter for you. Thank you for your time. Okay. It looks like a delivery box. Such amazing powers of deduction. I couldn't think of anything funny to say. There's a name badge in here. It belongs to Phoenix Rom. I'd like to ask you some questions. You may start my testimony. I found your name badge in the delivery box. That seems very suspicious to me. Maybe Phoenix stole the games. Objection! I sneezed earlier on. My badge must have flown into the box. Hang on. Why does my badge have tomato sauce on it? How do you think this sauce got onto your badge? No idea. I definitely haven't eaten anything with tomato sauce in it recently. How do you think this sauce got onto your badge? No idea. I definitely. Thank you for your time. Case dismissed. I'd like to ask you some questions. There's tomato sauce on this name badge. I often get red liquid spilt on me, but it's not tomato sauce. Thank you for your time. No problem, boy. I'd like to ask you some questions. The tomato stain on this badge looks like the stain on your armor. That's not tomato sauce. That's the blood of my enemies. Objection! Your enemies are aliens with green blood. No! Okay, yes, it's tomato sauce. But it's a totally different tomato sauce. New testimony added to statement. What are you talking about? Sorry, old habit from a previous career. I think I'll nip out to the police headquarters for a sauce detector. No one is to leave the store. Okay, all of you. Yeah. Hello. Wait. Okay. okay. Did you know the next X-Board console will have 80 teraflops? Ha! Huh. PlayStation 5 will have games on it! We only need one game! Ask Crackdown Under, an online only bum showdown set in Australia! I will spend 500 hours on it, minimum! Sounds thrilling! Got it! I can use this on people or objects to scan for sources and other things. That is definitely tomato sauce. I'd like to ask you some questions. Thank you for your time. Whatever. I'm detecting traces of coffee. Wow, that tool would have really come in handy during my courtroom days.
I'm detecting traces of farts. Oops. I'm detecting traces of Pepsi. The best drink on the planet. Nonsense! Coca-Cola is the best in the universe! What have I started? That wouldn't be very productive. That wouldn't be very... That would... That... That... That wouldn't be... That would... That wouldn't... That would... That would... That... 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 Not reading anything here. That wouldn't be... That would... That... That wouldn't... Aha! There's traces of tomato sauce on these boxes. Someone must have attempted to wipe them down. More boxes? On these goggle-its dead ear boxes. Oh! I forgot those were there. Nobody even shows any interest in those. Let me compare this sauce to the sauce on Master Chef. Well, what do you know? They're the same sauce. Ah, uh, so what? So I touch some boxes. Hmm. I think I'll move some of them. Well, what do you know? It's the stolen finally Final Fantasy games. I'll leave them there. The last finally Final Fantasy 30 games. Finally. I'd like to ask you some questions. You may stop my testimony. I found the stolen games. Oh, good job. Who stole them? Master Chef. That asshole. You should arrest them. Good idea. Thank you for your time. Case dismissed. I'd like to ask you some questions. You stole the games and hid them behind the It's Delia boxes, knowing nobody would move those. Alright, alright! It was me! I hid them! But they didn't leave the store, so you can't charge me with anything! Oh. Got no objections, Phoenix? Sorry, I have nothing. They're right. Still, this doesn't explain why you hid them. Isn't it obvious? Nope. It came out on export consoles too, after all. I don't know. I can't think of a reason. <sighs> Look at the cover! PlayStation owners get exclusive DLC! One single coin to spend in the game! That's it? It's the principle! So if I can't have it, no one will! But this is just one shop of thousands that sell it. Oh, I hadn't thought of that. PlayStation owners are so much more smarter. Clearly. Shut up, boy! I'm not a boy! Will you two leave the store, you time-wasting idiots? Oh my god! Abraham has been murdered? This case just got serious. It was always serious. Finally, Final Fantasy XXX is more important to me than my own father. Didn't you kill your own father? No, only slightly. He's dead, Jim. There's strangulation marks on his neck. He's dead, Jim. There's strangulation. I'd like to ask you some questions. You may stop my testimony. Who do you think killed Abraham? I refuse to speculate. It was you, wasn't it? Objection! I have no motive to kill him. He was the manager. Wouldn't that promote you to manager? No, the company would simply bring in another manager. Sucks to be you. Abraham has strangulation marks around his neck. Is there anything in this shop that could be used as a weapon to strangle someone? Hmm, most controllers are wireless now. Ah, but we do sell the Nintendo Wii Nunchuck. That has a cable. I see. Was that a Shenmue reference? Huh? Saying I see. It can be if you want it to be. 
Sweet. Where do you keep the nunchucks? Just here. Huh? We had one left, but it's disappeared. That's weird. There's a Nintendo Stitch here on the shelf where the nunchuck should have been. It's not store property. We sold out five months ago. It's so unfair. I want to play Animal Cross Stitching. That game is amazing. Ah, uh, I mean, that game isn't a real game. Real gamers play on export consoles. No, real gamers play on PlayStation, the holy mother of consoles. I don't really want Animal Cross Stitching. That's a fake game for girls. <laughs> Well, anyway, could you put the stitch on the counter? Sure. Do you think the stitch belongs to Master Chef or Protest? I couldn't say, but I'm willing to bet neither of them would openly admit to ever owning a stitch. Thank you for your time. Case dismissed. I need to find out who this belongs to. I'd like to ask you some questions. Does that stitch on the counter belong to you? That's not mine. Why don't you ask that export fanboy, Master Chef? Do you really think Master Chef owns that stitch? They're a fake gamer, so more than likely. Thank you for your time. No problem, boy. I'd like to ask you some questions. Protest says that stitch belongs to you. As if I would own that! I am loyal to Xboard! I would die for Xboard! Such is the strength of my loyalty to a corporation! I bet Crotus owns it! He doesn't understand loyalty! Do you really think Crotus owns that stitch? Definitely! He's all about playing baby games! Who do you think killed Abraham? Maybe he killed himself. Always think outside of the box. So he turned out the lights, killed himself, and then turned the lights back on. Maybe he had an accomplice. You smell. That's not I was weird. Thank you for your time. Whatever. I'd like to ask you some questions. Who do you think killed Abraham? The murderer. Gee, you think? Thank you for your time. No problem, boy. I'd like to ask you some questions. You may start my testimony. Who do you think killed Abraham? I refuse to speculate. It was you, wasn't it? Objection! I have no motive to kill him. He was the manager, wouldn't that- No, sucks Master Chef says the stitch belongs to Crotex. Uh, they would say that. Thank you for your time. Case dismissed. I don't have time to be playing games. He's dead. There's strangulation marks on the- I'd like to buy one of these console thingies. You and everyone else with a pulse. All sold out, I'm afraid. These are just dummy boxes. What's so special about- You can switch between pla- That- A bunch of colourful looking games. Sadly, all of these games are out of stock. I don't own anything that these games would run on. Most people don't. They can't find the console in stock to buy it. When I picked up my gun this morning, I accidentally picked up the wrong one. Mere water cannot hurt me! I am invincible! It's not as amusing when he's dead. Objection! 
What are you doing? I was trying to get you with this water pistol, but the range on it sucks. What a shame. Wait! Okay, it's mine! Don't get it wet! But it proves nothing! You don't even have the nunchuck murder weapon! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, uh, Ow! You're under arrest! Anything you say, not so fast, Detective Boiled Hard! Master Chef to Chief O'Brainy! Yes, sir! One to beam up! Captain, there's thermomatic hazardous isolated radiation particles in the air. It's far too risky to beam you up. Just do it, you imbecile! If you insist, nice knowing you. I guess I'll find a nice space station to live on after this fails. Beam me up now! Energizing. What? What happened? The beam out failed and you were returned, but your atoms got mixed up with everything else that was teleported. So now you're an amalgamation of you, your suit, your frying pan and your egg? Well not quite, Master Chef's human body was mostly lost, but I did manage to retain their brain. I guess now they're no longer a Master Chef warrior, there'll be a good egg from now on. <laughs> You're not dead? I was only unrendered unconscious. What? I, I don't believe it! Why did you attempt to kill him anyway? It was something to do! I know that feeling. Well, I guess that's the end of this case. I can't imagine what sort of case I could be investigating in the near future. I know, sir. It's Detective Boiled Hard. Case file, Death of the Space Dino Hunter. Out now on itch. Sounds like fun. Thanks, Chief O'Brainy. No problem. A Because Because Mini Game. The story was crudely written by Matt Barker. The coding was fluked by Matt Barker. The graphics were drawn with a mouse by Matt Barker. The music was unbelievably composed and recorded by Matt Barker. The sound effects were partially recorded by Matt Barker. Check out the full game of Detective Boardhard with a whole new story. Or check out Because Because his other point and click game, Trails and Traces, The Tomb of Thomas Tew. Or the older freeware title, Heaven, Hell and the Neville World. Bye!